This is our one bedroom villa at Saratoga Springs. We're in Congress Park. And it's room number 1230. Please excuse the mess. We're packing and moving to the studio today. Here's the entryway. Nice mirror and table. And that's the door that goes to the uh, joined studio. And this is a utility closet. I don't know if every villa has that or just happens to be ours. Some artwork. You walk down the little hallway. And here's the kitchen. It's pretty nice. Big microwave. And there's most of the dishes are in the dishwasher right now, but there's plates and mugs. The mugs are pretty small, but adequate. Oh, that's ours. I don't remember to bring that with. Glasses. There's a big plate up there. There's paper towels. Comes with plenty of paper towels. Dishes. There's more paper towels up there that came with the room. We didn't even go through them. One roll. And dishes in there. Nice size coffee maker. It's 12 cups. Toaster, tea kettle, stove. Um, we baked a pizza, had no problems with the stove. Baked normally. A deep sink, it's really nice, I like it. And they give you extra um, cleaning stuff if you need it on your last day. There's two garbage cans underneath the sink. Ice cube trays. Two drawers in the bottom there. And this is the living room, the fold-out couch. It also comes with a high chair. It um, is usually in the closet. Fold-out couch. A lamp. That's my son. And the balcony is very nice. And our view was great. Downtown Disney, it's just beautiful at night. The trees and the other buildings. This has a ceiling fan. This is a big chest that opens up. We actually stuck a piece of our luggage in there to keep it out of the way. A chair, another lamp. There's two drawers here for your clothing or whatever. Um, DVD player. A TV, it's not flat panel, but it's big. Remotes, channel guide. artwork. This is kind of a neat little bar area with a couple chairs. And this is the table with bench seating. It has a mirrored back. He's ready to go. Hi Henry. <laughs> All right. Climate control. <laughs> This is the laundry, which we're doing, as you can hear. Washer and dryer. They also give you an extra box of detergent on your towel day. And this empties into, <laughs> he's very ready to go, the master. This is also a big drawer. You can stick more clothes in or whatever. Mirror. And the big bed, sorry, unmade. That way. Yeah, <laughs> it comes that way. Another uh, large TV, not flat panel. More drawers, there's four of those. Um, there's not a DVD player in this room. Big area to store things. Comfy chair, lamp, artwork. Another big window. Beautiful views. desk and lamp, mirror, there's another desk, or another uh, end table over there with a lamp, another ceiling fan, it's very bright, very nice, 
this of course goes into the bathroom the whirlpool tub which was fantastic I had to try that out let's take a closer look in this room here nice marble countertop really big vanity held tons of products and whatever else you need this is actually storage down here too the only thing that was frustrating in this room was that there was no um, towel rack for your towel here so I had it slung over the drawer there they really should put a towel rack in here of some sort a ring or something here's the closet pillows and blankets and hangers, ironing board, pack and play, vacuum, full length mirror. Oh, the safe is also back here. There's the safe. We didn't use it. Um, looks like it might fit a laptop though. We were actually here when the housekeeping came in for the towel and trash day. It's the electric panel. And then through this door, you're back in the, that's the bedroom. So when you're coming back from the bedroom into here, this is into the room with the shower. Oops. I always get all these light switches mixed up. And this, sorry about the mess, again. Towels, um, lot, plenty of towels for everyone. Nice, nice big shower, really nice. The control is actually over here, so you can set it and get it warm while you get ready to get into the shower, which was wonderful. I loved it. I want to take the shower home with me. Beautiful marble or granite counters here. Pedestal sink with the ledge. And this door actually goes out into the living room. So at night, we had our son sleeping in the pack and play in the living room here. And my husband and I would be able to watch TV and enjoy and relax in the evening in our bedroom. And we could easily come into the bathroom and shower and whatever else without disturbing him because we could have this door shut. It was really great. Or if one of us were napping or anything. Really, really nice. And then this is the toilet. There's more towels here, um, a large towel and a washcloth. It's, this is, I also like that this is a separate room because someone can get ready here and someone can go to the bathroom at the same time or showering or whatever. Um, my husband often got ready in this room and I got ready in this room. So it worked out just really, really great. Really nice amenities. Everything, our stay was wonderful. The only complaint I probably have about the villa is that the carpet appears to be a bit worn. And see, there's a tear right there. And there was a wet spot on the floor when we came in. Not a huge deal, but kind of strange. You don't know what that wet spot is. I'll give you a view of the balcony here. These railings are nice and small. We'd let my son play out here while we were in the living room. He never had any problems. I wasn't nervous about him falling out or anything like that. Oh, it's just beautiful. Oh, gorgeous weather. It's one of those days and just want to sit in the sun all day. That's kind of our plan, so look forward to it. Enjoy the pool and this Congress Park actually has its own quiet pool and hot tub and play area which has been really great. We've taken advantage of all those. The table and chairs. Get a view of the balcony here over there so you can see the size. All right and that's our one bedroom villa at Saratoga Springs room number 1230 in Congress Park.